Hi everyone, welcome to Wedra Studio. Today, we are going to talk about platinum. So now let's get straight to it. Platinum is a precious metal with a silvery white lustrous appearance. It is well known for its beauty, durability, and diverse industrial applications. The name is derived from the Spanish word platina, which means little silver. It was first encountered by Spanish explorers in South America during the 18th century and initially considered as undesirable impurity in gold deposits. Did you know that ancient Egyptians used platinum in small decorative items? One of small artifacts containing platinum is a small box or casket dating to the 700 BCE. The Russian Empire issued platinum coins from 1828 to 1845, with face values of 3, 6, and 12 rubles. These coins were produced using platinum from the Ural Mountains. Platinum is typically found as a rare mineral in various geological settings. It is formed through natural processes and is often found in association with nickel and copper sulfide ores. Platinum can also occur in its elemental form known as native platinum. It is barely impure and consists of other minor impurities such as iron, copper, and nickel. The largest producers include South Africa, Russia, and Zimbabwe. Due to its low natural abundance, the mining and extraction of platinum can be economically challenging. Did you know that platinum is a very dense metal? Its density is about 21.45 grams per cubic centimeters and is denser than gold. A given volume of platinum is almost 60% heavier than the same volume of 14 karat gold. Platinum has a very high melting point of around 1,772 degrees Celsius and an even higher boiling point at 3,827 degrees Celsius, making it useful in high temperature applications. Platinum is a highly malleable and ductile metal, which means it can be easily shaped into various forms, making it ideal for jewelry and industrial processes. Platinum has a 4 to 4.5 rate on the Mohs hardness scale. It is relatively soft compared to some other metals, but it is still harder than many common materials. Along with gold and silver, platinum is considered as a noble metal. It is known for its resistance to corrosion and oxidation, suitable for applications that require durability and resistance to chemical reactions. Did you know that platinum has been used in the petroleum industry since the late 1950s? It catalyzes various refining processes, such as the removal of impurities from crude oil and the production of high-octane gasoline. It is also used as catalytic converters in automobile industry to reduce harmful emissions from vehicles such as carbon monoxide. Platinum is highly prized in the jewelry industry for its lustrous appearance, durability, and rarity. It is often used to make engagement rings, wedding bands, necklaces, and other fine jewelry. Platinum is hypoallergenic making it an excellent choice for individuals with metal allergies. It rarely tarnishes and will not cause skin reactions such as itchy rash. Nevertheless, platinum ages naturally and can develop a pattern over time, leading to a change in color. Some people prefer this look, while others can have their jewelry repolished to restore its original shine. Platinum is often used in medical implants such as pacemakers, due to its biocompatibility. It can also be found in dental alloys such as crowns, bridges, and dental braces. The word platinum is often used metaphorically to denote something of exceptional quality. A platinum record is awarded to a singer or group whose album has sold at least 1 million copies in the music industry. Investors often consider platinum as a precious metal alongside gold and silver. Platinum investing can take several forms, from small bars and coins to ETF trust funds and derivatives. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.